What's up guys, welcome back to the channel. Want to switch from iPhone to Android? But wait, what to do with my contacts, my pics, my embarrassing memos? How do I bring them all with me? Fear not, today I'm talking about how to seamlessly transfer your precious data from iPhone to Android. So make sure both your devices have enough power and let's jump into the first method, transfer data by smart switch on Android. This is a wireless way where two mobile phones are connected through the invisible hand of Wi-Fi. Got an iCloud account? Next, we'll tap into its powers for a smooth transition. No iCloud? No worries, we've got other tricks up our sleeve in the next method. Now open settings on your iPhone, tap your profile, and cozy up to iCloud. Decide which data gets to make the journey to Android and which stays put. Before we dive in, return to the previous page and double check that Find My iPhone is snoozing in settings. Now it's time for iCloud to work its magic. Head back to iCloud Backup and Backup Now. Once done, take your Android device and go to Settings. Navigation to the Account and Backup field. Its exact position may vary from your Android model. Tap on Bring Data from the old device and hit the Receive Data option. This feature welcomes transfers from Galaxy and Android phones too, but we're sticking with iPhone today. Then select Get Data from iCloud instead and fill in your Apple account. Next, you will get a prompt on your iPhone to allow the Android device to connect to your iCloud account. Just tap Allow and then enter your verification code on your Android device. Here, you can choose what you want to transfer. Remember to tap the arrow and select all to avoid any 30-day photo limitations. Do this for all your data and then tap transfer. That's it. If you have a lot of data, this process may take a long time. Please be patient. Method two, transfer data from iPhone to Android from Google Drive. In this method, just install Google Drive on your iPhone. Then sign into your Google account. Head to iPhone's Photos app and select a photo or video. Click the Share button in the lower left corner and choose Google Drive as your destination. Tap Account and select your Google account. Upload the selected photos or videos. Now pick your Android and open Google Drive. Your transferred photos and videos will be waiting there, ready to be admired on the new screen. Method 3. If you are looking for an easier way to transfer data from iPhone to Android, then you must try Tenashare iTransgo. Compared to traditional methods like manual copying or cloud backup, iTransgo tends to be faster, especially for large amounts of data. You can monitor the transfer progress in real time, giving you an estimate of how long it will take. First, connect both your devices to the computer. On your iPhone, tap Trust This Computer when prompted. Click on the Start button in the iOS to Android section. Follow the instructions to enable developer mode on your Android. In Settings, scroll down to the bottom. Tap About Phone. Software Information. Then tap the build number seven times in a row. Well done, return to settings, go to developer options, and enable USB debugging on your Android. Tap allow when prompted. Then, with just one click, iTransgo will install its handy connect app on your Android, making communication a breeze. Once done, tap start in a Transgo's interface. Select what you would like to bring to your Android. Then click Start Scan. Allow permission on your Android if prompted. Once done, click on Transfer Data. The software minimizes the risk of data loss or corruption during the transfer process. When transferring your data, your Android will go through a quick restore process. But don't worry, all the existing data on your Android will remain intact. Well done, now you can go ahead and check it out. See, all the photos have been transferred perfectly. And all your existing data on the Android is still there. So that's it. Thanks for watching.
Don't forget to give us a thumbs up if you succeed in one of the methods. I will be grateful if you subscribe. Stay tuned for our next videos.